and welcome back to the unboxers and today we have for you another awesome muppet and this time it is the swedish chef yes action figure with accessories so and maybe he'll actually cook us something yeah because he's gonna <laughs> he's full of action so uh we want to say a great big thank you to diamond select for sending him to us for free to share with you today and to add him to our muppets collection Muppets action figure collection. So there's the front of the box. Looks like he's going to come with... I think her name's Henrietta. Mm, I don't know why I want to say that. But anyway, there he comes with the chicken. Some pots and some vegetables and a table. Look at that. So it shows you... Whoa, he comes with quite a bit there. Yeah. Oh, and the vegetables have faces. Those <laughs> have very cool. Um, giant like um, salt shaker, pepper shaker, spice shaker. Oh, and a tennis racket. That's cool. Here's some of the other sets and that we have done. Yeah. Well, we did like the the blasting set where they yes. actually exploded something on that one. And then we did that one that comes with the really cool balcony. Yeah, that one set. was awesome. Awesome. All right, so it's time to get the Swedish chef out of his box and give you a much closer look. We'll be right back. All right, so there he is, the Swedish chef <laughs> and all of his accessories. Yes, oh my goodness. So I'm going to go ahead and start now because he has a ton of things to show off. Let's start up here. So he's got some cookware. So I was going to say, hold on to your cookware. We've got a lot to show you. So he's got two silver pots, uh, like medium size right here, but I think there's a third one inside there. Might be a little taller. I'm going to start with the frying pans. So he's got all of these frying pans, itty bitty, medium, larger, and extra large. Very cool that he has so many sizes to choose from. And he's got this pot with a handle. I put the little, this is like beef meat inside there. Mm -hmm. Almost like he's stirring up something. I guess it could be chocolate, but it's got lumps in it. So I don't know exactly what he's stirring up there, but something good. Oh, he's got this really cool shaker to add the spices and he's got i thought this was a peel but it's actually like a griddle so you can see it's very cool and um let's see here a mallet to pound things out with um and then he's got a whole um let me see here's the tennis racket yes. this has something to do with the chicken i think like i remember one of these things doesn't belong yeah <laughs> But there's a, there's definitely a scene or a skit with him yeah. and the chicken. So I'm going to show off these little teeny ones. You hold your hand out there, John, so I can... Oh. Okay, so we got a, oh, nope, a fork up. and a rolling oh. pin. The fork is stuck to the rolling pin. We have a... A cleaver. A cleaver. Uh, we have a ladle, which is really cool. Ladle, ladle. Let me back this up a little bit. Okay, and we have two different types of spatulas. We have this kind, rounded off, and then we have squared off, and then we have this soup spoon. Uh -oh. oh! And then we have another little brown tasting spoon. We have this pot, which is... We have this pot, which is uh, taller than the other two that I showed you, but about the same around diameter. And then this one, which is um, the same size, but bigger. I mean, the same uh, height, but bigger around a bigger diameter so we have all of that goodness you want to put those accessories back in the pot <laughs> and now we can oh and i have some special ones to show off here these are so cute and so tiny so i want to make sure you can see them well here's the carrot with a face look how cute it is talking carrot i do remember these now that i see the faces on them and this one looks like this one looks like an apple so with a little face on it and then we have the onion which is actually crying <laughs> you can see a little tear on the onion um and then we have the chicken i don't know if this is gonzo's chicken or not but it certainly does look like her yeah i thought her name was henrietta not exactly sure but anyway there she is in all of her chicken glory and uh she's still alive and she has and then he has these um i call them the well, these are kind of like the cooking hands because yeah. these hold on to the pot handles and stuff like that. And the So if you need to grip any of this stuff, these are the hands that you'll need to swap them out for. All right. And now it's time to look at the, the Swedish, Swedish chef. chef. So let's take a look. There's this really cool facial sculpt. There's his awesome purple nose. 
You can't see his eyes because his eyebrows always covered him up. <laughs> He's got an awesome mustache. He's got his iconic mouth, his little ears, and his hair around the back, which is cute. And he's also got his hat, which has got all the folds in it and stuff. And then he's got his apron on, which is awesome. His shirt, which reminds me of like barbershop quartet. Yeah. Shirt. It's got the stripes in there. Got the really cool pink bow tie. Um, and he's got the folds around here because he's been tasting all of his awesome food. He is married, it looks like. Yeah, I have no idea. <laughs> but um, anyway, so I don't know if she's Swedish as well. But um, And then he's got these awesome plaid pants. I don't think I've ever seen an action figure with, yeah. pa with pants like this. So he is definitely one of a kind. He looks like he stepped right off of the show. Yeah, he really does. He looks awesome. All right, now show off his articulation because he is quite articulated for a chef. All right, so let's take a look. So he has... Uh, neck articulation, so it'll go back and forth. He can, it'll uh, go um, up and back to certain, um, slightly and even kind of tilt a little bit. He's got shoulder articulation and it will rotate as well as extend. Uh, he's got elbow and the elbow will rotate as well. He's got the dual wrists, so it will twist as well as bend. Um, he has really good articulation at the waist. His legs actually go out, um, but they will also rotate um, if you want to, uh, you know, if you want to have him walking or something. Um, he has uh, knee articulation, and the knee is just like the elbow. It will rotate as well as bend, and then the ankle articulation, so it'll go up and back and um, side to side a, a little bit, but um, the pant leg kind of keeps it from rotating too much, but he looks really cool. All right, so there's another last look at the Swedish chef from the Muppets. We want to say another great big thank you to Diamond Select for sending him to us for free to share with you today. He definitely will help complete our Muppets yeah. collection. He looks he is awesome. Gonna be a welcome addition for sure. And look at all that stuff he has to share. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, not so much food to cook, but he's got a lot of cookware. <laughs> thank you so much for watching. As always, come back and see us. Like, subscribe, and we will see you next time.